it uh, was, uh, was not a happy marriage. You gotta talk it out, guys. Don't go to bed angry. I gotta, uh, I gotta get out of here soon. I'm like uh, halfway through uh, last week's voicemail from my mom. I don't know if you guys have the same mother as I do. Do you have the same mother as I do? That would be strange. There's a lot of people here, but uh, I don't know. Same, it's the same voicemail every single time. Every single time she calls, same exact voicemail. It's uh, just it's like, uh, "Hello, Nathan. It's your mother. I would uh, really like to talk to you, but apparently I'm not worth picking up the phone for. So I'll just talk into your phone for the next 10 to 20 minutes, or whenever I run out of breath and pass out." I, your aunt Denise is doing fine, so don't worry about your aunt Denise. And, um, you know, I gotta be honest, I don't know why you insist on using this voice for me in your act. I was born and raised in the Midwest, so I don't talk like this. And as my son, you know I converted to Judaism, so there's really no reason why I would ever talk like this, but... I know you're doing stand-up comedy, and you're only on stage for so long, and it's it's hard in that amount of time to give an accurate portrayal of a nuanced woman, and uh, <laughs> this is a trope that people will hear and know that it means a nagging mother, and to be honest with your tone of voice, it sounds more like a weak man. 